Zangry today. Northeast, blowing pretty good. We're at the mouth of Oak Orchard Creek at Point Breeze. We're gonna fish the inside of this pier. Try and get in the lee a little bit, see how it goes. Haven't seen anything jumping in the river yet here. Very few people fishing. Didn't see anything while I was rigging up, but we're gonna give it a try. So the night before we had gotten some rain. You can see the water's a little murky, not bad. It's got a nice green color to it. And uh, a lot of people like to fish casting spoons off the pier, but today we're primarily going to fish uh, stick baits. Got a spinning reel set up, 20 pound Power Pro braid, 50 pound Spro swivel to attach our leader. Our leader's uh, about 4 feet of 15 pound mono. We got a snap swivel and then our size 15 jointed bomber here. That's what we're going to do most of our damage with today. Um, so right after I got there, I noticed the guy fishing right down for me, hooked up. He was using a jointed Fire Tiger Revolver. And I just started fishing, so I decided to hop down the rocks and check out his fish. What is he, about 15, you think? 17. 17? Nice fish, man. Awesome job. I saw a couple small ones move up past me right in front of me here, so. Did he? That's awesome. Nice job, man. Good luck. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> Yeah, it's the right color, man. So, unfortunately, I didn't do the greatest with GoPro on this trip here. This was like my uh, second cast. I didn't even have the camera fired up yet. And uh, this guy grabbed it. A uh, nice little male, about 10, 12 pounds. It's the first fish on the yeah. bomber. And uh, he ran me right down the shoreline. The guy fishing to the left of me was able to net him for me, and I got him up on the pier. Osprey right here. Just took a swipe at one. You miss. They don't miss very often. Alright, so we just caught one. Let's see if I can get some of these fish in the river. We got some rain last night. Um, got all kinds of fish rising now. Got a lot more current coming out. I didn't even have the camera on yet. Caught one second cast there. Fish on. Smoke that plug again. Bigger, I believe. I'm liking that. It's a 
jointed bomber long A suspending with uh yeah I'm just trying to slow them down right now. Green back on it, silver. I'm gonna have to go down the pier here. out of uh, SD card there, um, but that fish took us all the way down to the end of the pier head, and uh, I netted it out on the end there for me, so it's a nicer fish, probably 15 pounds or so, again it hit that uh, bomber, so I'm going to get them stringed up, get rigged up, and I'll be back. There on a spoon, it's got a wheel back, looks like. Nice. We just had a large mouth on. He jumped and threw the hook, so there's definitely bass in here. I think it's a quill back. Let me I think I think bring it down here. Let me let me look at it a little closer. Oh, that's a, uh, no, it's not cool, Mac. Thank you. I'm not sure. It's, it almost looks like a, uh, let me smell it. No, it's not a white fish. I was going to say, it almost looks like a white fish, yeah, but they smell like cucumbers. White fish, too. Yeah. yeah, that's what, it must be some kind of shad or something. Yeah, I'm not sure, man. I'm not eating, I don't know. Yeah, it does. I thought it was no, it's definitely. Yeah, it's definitely not a sheep head though. It's no, no, it's not. Yeah, yeah, I thought it was a quill back at first, but no, it looks like some kind of shad to me. Yeah, cool. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I hear you. Yeah. No, I just had a bass on too, a largemouth. That's what all a lot of the splashing. I think there's bass in there. He jumped and threw the hook. Yeah, no, I'm not sure, man. So whatever those suckers are, a bunch of them out there too. So yeah, just had one on, snagged one. A bunch of scales on the hooks. So I get a close up. If I don't fall on the rocks here. Yeah, it's sweet, man. Nice Very little big, brown. Did you get the brown on a spoon too? Yeah. All right. Yeah, this is on, so. Cool, thank you. Yep. Well, that's gonna be it for us today, guys. I think the bite's over. Um, man, we got here just the right time, though. Got two nice fish. Uh, I'm gonna go get them on ice. And uh, yeah, we'll be back. The salmon are really just starting to come in heavy. There's a few browns. Saw the guy at the end there. Had a nice, decent brown, sm smaller brown, really. Um, and uh, no rainbows yet, so it's a lot more good stuff to come. We'll definitely be back. So these are the two we ended up with, guys. Got one male, one female here, I believe. We can probably get some eggs out of her cure some eggs for fishing in the stream later in the year um, bites over seems to be uh, still some fish splashing but definitely salmon just starting to move up um, and uh, a few browns saw that one guy had a small brown out there on the end caught it on a spoon so no rainbows yet rainbows will be coming so we got a lot more good fishing to come here so Hang in there, stay tuned.